Hey everybody, Scott Sprinter here, DocSports.com, and welcome to the update, XFL Weekly Update. We've got an XFL free pick coming up in just a moment. First quick note, if you've yet to become a member at DocSports.com, just want to give it a trial run, click on the link below the video, get set up for a free $60 account, and then you can use those free $60 on any of my Disney packages or anybody else. Again, click on the link to get started. All right, uh, here's what's going on for us this weekend. First of all, uh, because you're watching an XFL video, our XFL plays now free and premium combined have got eight and three against the spread so far this inaugural season. I've got two plays for this week's action in the XFL. Uh, one goes on Saturday, one goes on Sunday. Both plays available in the same package right now over at DocSports.com. Anytime after 11.30 a.m. Eastern, 8.30 a.m. Pacific, you'll be able to get my XFL package for the weekend, which means you get the Saturday play, you get the Sunday play, all in one report as we look to stay hot in the XFL. Uh, I've also got a seven-star play in college basketball. My lead play on Saturday, it's a multiple-game college basketball card. It'll be available at 11.30 a.m. Eastern also. And uh, with last night's five-star win on Richmond, we are now on 5-1 and one since last Sunday. And long-term, 11-3, and 79% runs uh, in with our elite-level plays, which are those rated five stars and higher. So let's do it again. We won last night with Richmond. We've got a seven-star college basketball play part of Saturday's slate. It'll be available. 11.30 a.m. Eastern, my NBA at 1 p.m. Eastern, my UFC. Last five cards were up over 17 units. I've got two plays in Saturday's UFC 248. They're available right now as I speak, UFC at DocSports.com on my Handicappers homepage. NASCAR will be available Saturday night, 11 p.m. Pacific for Sunday's card. Let's get to our free pick for this weekend in the XFL, and we're going to play the under between New York and Dallas right now. The total for the most part sitting right around 37. And listen, uh, uh, this is a Saturday night, Saturday night game, excuse me, by the way. Uh, New York's pretty good on defense, while the other Dallas tends to play a, a conservative approach or brand of offense, if you will. Uh, when Landry Jones isn't behind center, and he's not, he's injured, he's going to be out for a few weeks. And due to this injury, due to Landry Jones' absence, they're going to go with Philip Nelson at quarterback on the Dallas Cowboys. Now, he completed, it sounds great, 33 of 42 passes in his week one start. But guess what? It was all dump-offs, short little routes. He goes 33 for 42, but he averaged just over five yards per pass attempt. They lost that opening game 15 to nine. The offense couldn't do anything. I think we're in for a conservative game. I, I don't like the quarterback situation for New York either. Uh, Matt McGloin's out. That doesn't matter to me. Uh, he was the best of what they had, and he was bad. And so I think you're going to see a lower scoring game. Uh, we're going to recommend a play on the under, which was right now as I speak, 37, the under between New York and Dallas our XFL free pick for this week. And again, don't forget my premium picks in the XFL. You get them both on one report. They'll be available 11.30 a.m. Eastern, 8.30 a.m. Pacific time on Saturday. We'll look to continue to stay hot in the inaugural season of the XFL. Hey, don't forget to check out my two college basketball videos for Saturday. And if you like these videos, click on that thumbs up button. Be sure to subscribe. I do appreciate those who have done so thus far. I'm Scott Spritzer, DocSports.com. Let's put the weekend of XFL in the win column. We'll be right back here with our next XFL report next Friday night for the weekend card. We'll talk to you then.